As we get set for dangerously cold temperatures and wind chill, it is stirring memories of 1996. That's when a small town in northern Minnesota recorded the coldest temperature ever. The Twin Cities saw the mercury dip to negative 32. But a weather station in Tower registered a raw air temperature of 60 degrees below zero. Bill Hudson takes a look back. Well, this is the weather station here at the St. Paul campus. Inside this chain link fence is recorded the ebb and flow of our weather. So to reset it, you go like this. And nothing reveals our state's fabric more than mercury. We had minus 32 here. So that was the last time we had minus 30 here in the Twin Cities. Climatologist Pete Boulay recalls the winter of 1996 when a bitter blast of polar air put Minnesota in the crosshairs. Yep, yeah, just outside a tower. Um, minus 60, and that's the state record. Our hearty pride was soon on display. I survived t shirts became hot sellers. CCO photographer Pete Newswanger recalls the glitch that cost Embarrass the record. People got very upset. They were blaming the, the uh, television cameras for keeping the temperature of the thermometer uh, a degree or two warmer so that tower could win. The cold was so dangerous, Governor Arnie Carlson closed all schools. I particularly remember children without any kind of mittens or gloves. Now spending winters in Florida. He calls that decision simple common sense. I'd rather see children go to school an extra day in June rather than suffer on the streets uh, freezing uh, in January. But for me, I'll always remember the funeral of slain St. Joseph police officer Brian Kleinfelter. For some, the most brutally cold day would never warm. WCCO 4 News.